Matty O'Brien's Grand Slam lifts the Seminoles to a series win over NC State as Lacey Waldrop pitches two complete games, her second and third straight complete games for the Seminoles as they honor their legends of the past 30 years for Florida State fast pitch. As soon as I hit it, I just started fist bumping and yelling, yeah, baby. Um, it was just really exciting. You know, I just was struggling all day and um, my Seminole family got on base for me and that's, you know, big for them. And if they can get on base, that's they're counting on me to drive them in and our 3-4 hitters so I just was trying to see the ball up and deliver for my family. I get excited. I get excited when she comes to play. I get excited when you know I mean our whole team right now they're just putting a lot of time in here you know Maddie puts a ton of time in the cage, Courtney puts a ton of time in the cage so you just get really excited for them for the opportunity. How cool is that the opportunity to win a ball game right there? Doing pretty good. Um, it was definitely exciting to go head to head against them again because once you get to postseason that's what you're gonna face. You're gonna have great teams and you're gonna have to get them back to back so it was a great day but my defense did a really great job playing behind me and just making me feel comfortable even when my arms started to get a little tired. Lacey's all heart, we all know that. You know, She's been a heart player from day one for us and um, a very emotional and passionate kid and um, you know she kind of had him tied up in knots a little bit so I said oh, let's go for another seven see if we can get out of you and she didn't have her best stuff there but the team played behind her you know again which is a great mark of the program. It's huge I mean this last game just showed like a lot of fight from our team and just rolling into tomorrow with two under our belt is huge and I mean with weather coming you never know so taking two to Today was really important for us. It was awesome the first game coming out swinging the bats and then you know getting down at the very beginning of the second game it, it kind of gets you a little bit but then I saw some huge adjustments from the batters and just there wasn't we didn't lose the fight we just kept going towards the end and made our adjustments and we did a great job. Just to hear all the accolades throughout the day was just outstanding so I'm um, great um, to have everyone back. Uh, this program's really moving forward, and it's, it's just, you know, everyone's been a big part of it, so it's been a lot of fun. Florida State will now try to squeeze one last game in before the rain comes tomorrow. Stay tuned right here for a first pitch. It is scheduled for noon, but could change as Florida State will look to sweep the first ACC series of the season. At Joanne Graff Field, Jonathan Schlacey, Semmels.com.